Okay, today we will be calibrating the MSA Altair 4X gas monitor. We will turn the unit on. It'll go through its startup process before we start the calibration. If you're not using a docking station, if you're doing it manually like I'm going to do, you have your cylinder of cow gas, you want to make sure you have the right concentrations for the gas detector that you're calibrating. Of course, you have a regulator here that lets the flow of gas out of the cylinder. And every gas monitor has its own unique calibration cap depending on the model of gas detector. And to put the Altair 4X into calibration mode, we push and hold down the right button. It'll prompt if you want a zero cal it. Zero cal is fresh air. We are in fresh air. As you can see, the uh, screen reads sensor refresh. And this is part of the zero calibration of the sensors. If this passes, if the sensors all pass the zero cal, it will then prompt to apply gas. We acknowledge yes, and then simply apply the gas to the monitor. As you can see, the zero passed. Span cow question mark, we want to acknowledge yes with a center button, and now we can apply gas. This snaps on. Turn the gas on. And you'll see the readings on the display screen here, responding to the gas during the calibration. These numbers should reflect the concentration in the cylinder for each gas component. And you can see span pass. Whenever you see the word span or cal span, that always means cylinder gas. Shut the flow off with the regulator. The unit is now purging the gas. The check mark in the upper right corner there means that the unit has either been calibrated or bump tested today. In this case it was a it was a calibration. And that is how simple it is to calibrate the MSA Altair 4X gas monitor.